I guess I'd have to say any number of the Odinata would be my favorite insect. <laughs> Within that, probably maybe the, the common green darner, just because they not only do they uh, they big and, and, and fun to watch, but many of them migrate tremendous distances, and uh, we're, people are still trying to figure out exactly where the migrants are coming from into Michigan in the spring. But Michigan has not only migrant dragonflies, green darters coming, but they also have native ones that spend the overwinter as larvae. So we have two, maybe we have two genotypes, we don't know. Uh, parasitoid wasps, specifically dryanids, because they have cool pincer claws. My favorite insect would be a mosquito. My favorite insects have to be the lacewings in general. If I had to choose one among the lacewings in Ken, I am quite partial to Barothids because they have alimones or toxic farts that they use to assault termites. The Parapanera clavata, the bullet ant. And that's really cool because this ant has more human mythology and suspicion, superstition going with it. And a lot of it is real. You know, it's true. This, this thing. It's called Bainti Quattro Omega, which means 24-hour ant, that you're going to die in 24 hours. It's called Bala, which is bullet, which means you feel like you get hit by a bullet. It's just a really cool thing. It's used in puberty rites. So, hey, if you think we have it bad as a teenage boys, think about some of these poor people in Amazonas that have to put their hands in a mitt, and they're getting these dozens of stings to them, where one sting will take a grown football player and get them rolling around in the field, you know, these things are just amazingly painful. So that's, that's one of my favorites. Lucilia sericata, it's a blowfly.